Well before most of us were born, prominent forester Jack Westerby summed up a large Australian timber congress by putting to the audience, this is an old congress, and I think you ought to do your best to make sure that the next one is not an old congress. Some of you are directors, some are managers. It will pay your firm better to have you spend a week on the golf course and send one of your youngsters instead. I'm happy to see that here tonight, we are definitely not an old Congress. I think it's a big event for Asia, especially in, forest, in, especially in forestry issue. And then I think as a youth, uh, this is my big opportunity to, to, be, he to be heard by all of the stake main stakeholders in the forestry in Southeast Asia. Yeah, I think the, the voice of youth is incredibly important. Um, youth are going to be affected by the policies that are made today. So having youth involved in the development of these policies and have their, having their voice active in these discussions is incredibly important. The youth can um, help the local communities um, to manage their forests. They can go to communities and help them um, cultivate their plantations uh, better and more, in a more sustainable way. The youth is the inheritor of this planet, so the youth is very important in terms of promoting the knowledge in forestry and promote the importance of forests and trees. It was wonderful to have so many different participants from all over the world, like Indonesia and the US, just really coming and share their unique expertise. I learned so much personally. Youth are integral in bringing forests into the green economy, in managing forests in a way that actually achieves these very, very ambitious green economy goals that our current leaders are setting for us to follow.